I'm a great admirer of what she's done. I was very impressed with her trip from uh, Cape Town to Goodwood. Yes. And um, I was talking to her after she landed, after that terrible time, yes. when in the very teeth of the terrible storm, she was delayed for 10 days coming back into Europe. Um, and she arrived in Goodwood at dusk on the last day of last year in filthy weather, with nobody to help her on the ground. No radios or anything. And that was about as trip as you can get. I'm here at Targ Farnborough with fabulous private jets behind me and I'm seeing Tracy Curtis Taylor who's setting off to Australia following the footsteps of one of aviation luminaries, Amy Johnson. And she's going in a Boeing Stearman biplane, incredibly brave courageous woman and there's a selection of well wishes to see her off so from me and all the rest of us good luck Tracy where's my head yeah. I need to actually start thinking about the flight because we had to change the flight plan at the last minute so I'm half thinking about the aeroplane and I've got kit sort of spread around the place so I'm slightly anxious about that but I still have to see a few people there's lots of old friends my family are here Amy Johnson's family is here and of course Bruce Michael is here so we're gonna have a few speeches. Ted Long Redwater are really pleased to host the event today and to help Tracy to recreate this epic journey, especially as far Farber being the oldest airfield in the UK where the first powered flight took place. Yeah, women in aviation, there have been very few of them historically. They've all shown immense courage, which is what Tracy is doing, and uh, initiative. They've had to fight really hard to, to uh, do their flights, which Tracy has had to do, and a vast amount of organization. And it was very sweet, because I did ask her what would happen. I said, what would happen if you have to ditch Tracy? And she said, I'd be really hacked off if I lost the aeroplane. That's her attitude, and it's wonderful. Um, I'm here today because I'm passionate about flying and about women flying and I want to make sure that more women enjoy flying either commercially or recreationally and Tracy is going to be such an amazing role model to encourage young women to do that.